Hello everyone, my name is Shree and welcome back to my channel and welcome to a very exciting Minecraft video. If you're not aware, on Thursday the 30th of January, a lot of the Minecraft developers at Mojang started to tweet out various pictures and posts on Twitter from the brand new 1.16 Nether update. Now, unfortunately, we won't be getting a Minecraft snapshot this week, but I think we can definitely expect one maybe Tuesday, Wednesday, or Thursday next week, which is going to be absolutely insane. I cannot wait for this Nether update. So first of all, we have Kojo, uh, Kojo Max 99 If you don't know who he is, he's basically one of the main modders of the Tropicraft mod, and he's a great guy. I've talked to him many times on Twitter. And this is uh, the tweet that he sent out. So it's a shock emoji you can see, and this tweet here. Honestly, these pictures right here are so cool. Like everything about it, you can see like quartz up here and glowstone as well. But you can see like blue mushrooms in a red biome, and I think. Most of us assume that the blue mushroom would only be in the blue nether biome, but apparently they can be anywhere. You see these really cool, like fire red, almost like nether vines, and these are nether block trees as well. And a good question that a lot of people have had is like, how do we actually grow the nether block trees? Because obviously we have nether wart blocks already in Minecraft, but are they going to be saplings? Are they going to be a specific kind of wood type? Because it all looks like a continuous nether wart block. That's going to be pretty awesome. The one thing I do love about this picture, which I don't think a lot of people have actually pointed out, but the actual red fog is actually pretty cool. And you have these like um, almost like night bugs or light bugs um, kind of effect to them. It's almost like the nether has already got its own like kind of stardust kind of thing. And also, if you look down here, the nether blocks actually look weird. They look different. Like there's netherrack here, but this stuff down here is lighter and darker than the netherrack above it. So that might just be the lava lighting it up. But those two blocks right there look very different to me. So now we're going to move over to Slice Lime's tweet. And Slice Lime, um, he confirmed that there was no snapshot this week. Uh, but he did give us another image right here, similar to Kojo's image. Let me close that right there. And again, you can see the red fog. You can see the beautiful vines. And there's, I think this is one of the new grass blocks that's going to be added to the nether update as well. It's kind of like a a nether bush or a nether grass block. Again, it's just, it looks so awesome, like, to see trees in the nether and red fog everywhere. And it's just, this is the nether update we've been waiting for. We've been waiting for this for so long. This one is very interesting to me. Let me just mute this. Um... This is Bartek Bok. I think he's another developer. I've never actually heard of him before. The first time I saw him was on uh, my Twitter um, feed. But if you press play on this video, you'll see that there's something very interesting in this video. Now, just <laughs> ignore the sheep. Um, but in the background, you can see this right here. Um, and the strange thing about it is that it's actually going downwards. Like the block itself starts in the air here. And it goes, it falls downwards like it's rain, which is very peculiar. Why is this not playing now? It's just stopped. There we go. So you can see it starts from the top and it goes down. It's not a firework. It's not a rain particle. So that's going to be interesting to see what that is. That might be indicating like the physics in the nether is completely different to how it is in the overworld. So the liquid goes upwards instead of downwards. I'm not very sure, but that is very interesting it might be a small particle thing <laughs> it might be like the fog the blue and red fog i was talking about earlier but that's still pretty cool i'm actually very interested to see that in the newest snapshots next week hopefully and obviously minecraft themselves have tweeted out a few pictures from the nether biomes over here you can see the blue nether biome there we go it's loading <laughs> there we go so you, again you see this uh, blue grass over here the lava falling down it's very dark it's actually quite much darker than the red one. It might just be the um, editing of the video. We actually have a um, red mushroom over here as well. So this whole thing is looking pretty cool. Like I just, I cannot wait for this update. I cannot explain how much. Um, and here we have another one as well uh, with some red nether blocks. These are the um, nether wart blocks I was talking about before. Again, we have the grass. Um, so I'm wondering if the nether is going to be uh, like the 
landscape of it is going to be just nether wart or if they're going to combine the nether wart and the nether wart blocks together um sorry not nether wart the nether bricks and oh, i was trying to <laughs> the netherrack <laughs> netherrack if they're going to just have netherrack as it usually is or if they're going to combine the netherrack and the nether wart blocks that would be pretty cool um so i'm just waiting i, I really want to know what they're going to do with the nether wart trees like that is my main thing, because I'm all about blocks and building blocks, so I want to see what the planks look like, I want to see what the stairs and the slabs look like, if there's going to be any nether wart block fences. Oh, that would, wow. It's a circle, but I really do, like, not a lot of people are think, talking about it, but I really do like the fog. <laughs> like, I like the fog. The thought of there being blue and red fog in Minecraft in the nether. It's pretty cool. And last but not least, we have Owlraf, again, a Minecraft developer that I did not know until last week or this week and here is another image of the blue nether forest um, this time we've got a different type of oh this one looks like it's got grass on it look at that it's like netherrack but it's got like greenish tinted blue grass on it that's pretty cool and these are different as well these oh, those aren't those aren't those aren't glowstone these aren't glowstone oh oh either they are glowstone or they've changed the oh wait a minute well, they've changed the texture of it because in this one they're not glowstone <gasps> they're not i was right they're not glowstone oh so what is this then because when i first saw it on, on um, cory or kojo's um picture i was like these are glowstone and whoa i really thought they were peeling chests or something but these are interesting. Look at this. Wow. So maybe, actually, they have added bees. So maybe we're going to get some kind of nether bee or some nether honeycomb or something. But this is crazy. Huh. There we go. That's something new. <laughs> so if you are looking forward to this nether update as much as I am, please leave a like and a comment down below. Tell me what you're most excited about the nether update. If you're going to be playing the snapshots and stuff, and please look forward to my nether snapshot videos next week. I cannot wait. I will leave all the links for these pictures in the description down below so you can go ahead and look at them for yourself. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, everyone.